सदाशिवसमारंभा शंकराचार्य मध्यमस्मदाचार्य प्रियंता वंदे गुरुपरंपरा श्रुति स्मृतिपुराणाकुणाल नमा भगवत्द शंकरोकशंक शंकर शंकराचार्य केशव बादुरायण सूत्रभाष्यत वंदे भगवत पुनः पुनः ईश्वरो गुरुरात्मे मूर्ति भेद विभागिने व्योमतीहाय दक्षिणाूर्त नम शहनावत सहन वन सह वीर करवाहीदाश्चुमुति प्रकाश मुक्षुर्वे शरण प्रपद्ये शाशाशाति आकृति from veda shabda therefore veda shabda are also nitya ateva ch nityatva di kartru smaranat siddham eva veda nityatvam anena dridikritam iti bodhyam what has been established by guru mimamsa kas that has been made firm by this analysis with this understanding the earlier establishment of nityatvam of vedas also becomes firm you have more reasoning now you have more logic to support then the next sutra we uh, yeah we were just looking at this at the end of the patha nanu mahapralaye nanu mahapralaye akruti hi just lot of noise here oh there is a bee here okay कि नु महाप्रलय आकृते अनीत्यवाद्दाबंध से अनीत्यवरोधा तरवस्था इतिहाशंख्या दार्शनिक शब्द वेद शब्द इज ऑलसो शब्द पूर्वमीमसका से शब्द इज नि Tarkika does not agree. Vyakarana and Puramimamsa, as well as Uttaramimamsa, say that Shabda is Nitya, whereas Tarkika says Shabda is Anitya. Shabda is Utpatti and Nasha, therefore Shabda is Anitya. But Vyakarana and Mimamsa, Mimamsa ka, they say that Shabda is Nitya. Just like घटा, when you say घटा, घटा शब्द और गो शब्द, घटा शब्द, all these शब्दाज have उत्पत्ति और नाशा. तार्किका says therefore शब्द cannot be नित्य. But the व्याकरणाज, व्याकरणाज meaning those who follow sporta vada and नियमांशकाज say that when you talk about घटा, what comes to the mind is घटा पदार्थ. when ghata pada is uttered or you hear it then what comes to you your mind is ghata padartha the akruti vishesha so when you listen to the ghata shabda pointing to ghata vyakti the ghata jati comes to the mind what we are looking at when you hear the go shabda the last part ha go shabda the gotva is the artha there the artha of ghata shabda is ghatatva that ghatatva jati mat is the ghata padartha 
therefore ghatatva is understood and that comes to the mind as ghatapadartha so even if the vyakti is meant in the vakya that you hear still between the vyaktis there is bheda but ghata ghata the nama ghata ghata iti ghata iti when you say that there is eka shabdatvam also because between the ghata arthas padarthas although there is vyakti bheda still jati bheda is in there and that jati bheda is the shakyartha of the ghata shabda the jati not the vyakti bheda but the jati artha is the padartha is the shakyartha of the ghata shabda therefore eka shabdatvam this one is also ghata that one is also ghata thereby that eka shabdatvena nityatvam of ghata shabda also let alone vaidika shabda but each and every shabda is nitya there then what is uchcharana which is uh, anitya as per tarkika the puro vimamsaka as well as vyakarana vyakarana they say that this nitya shabda which is the eka shabda for ghata that uchcharana is abhivyakti matra it is just manifestation of that nitya shabda and manifestation has an utpatti and nasha so ghata shabda that you hear has an utpatti or nasha but the jati is nitya the eka shabda ghata ghata iti that shabda is nitya then if the tarkika argues as still what we are talking about is what i heard that shabda is having utpatti and nasha and it points to a ghata vyakti therefore even if you talk about ghata as a jati the eka shabda as a jati ghatatva jati pointing to ghatatva jati what i hear and what i understand is the vyakti how does that understanding take place if ghatatva jati is the artha shakya artha so there the siddhanti meaning vyakarana or mimamsaka purva or uttar mimamsaka they have a similar view there so we will say siddhanta is that ghatatva jati stu vyakti minana tishtati when you say ghata manaya then it is not bring any ghata it does not mean definitely does not mean mean bring all ghatas it is eka vachana it means bring one ghata it does not mean bring any ghata but it means bring the closest ghata which is known to the listener or tatparya of the speaker can be understood by the listener that the speaker knows therefore is a ghata manaya that time that vyakti ghata vyakti that the listener has to bring that vyakti cannot remain without jati sir so, sorry uh, that jati cannot remain without vyakti so even if the shakyartha is jati how does the listener understand the vyakti because jati remains in a vyakti ghatatva is in all ghatas all ghata vyaktis so ghatatva jati is in all ghata ghata vyaktis similarly when you hear ghata manaya that time although the ghata shab- shabdartha is ghatatva jati still it will be in a in each and every vyakti so which vyakti will you bring definitely not all vyaktis so you will bring the closest or whatever is meant as a tatparya by the speaker that you know the you know the vivaksha and then by understanding the vivaksha you bring that particular ghata only the ghata vyakti so the purva paksha tarkika tarkika is ex- purva pakshi tar- tarkika and tarkika's purva paksha as to how does one understand a jati from hearing ghata if at all the ghata shabda has shakyartha in ghatatva so it is answered as 
the jati cannot remain without vyakti so even if the meaning is jati vyakti is understood clearly and therefore the ghata idi shabda the ghata shabda and ghatatva jati both are nitya and therefore the sambandha between them is also nitya so shabda is nitya and ghatatva jati which is the artha is nitya between them the sambandha pada padarthyo sambandha is also nitya this is the vyakarana and mimamsa mata vedanti agrees to that and therefore uh, the analysis here is in line with vedanta also puro mimamsa also okay so now moving on to the mahapralaye akruti he api anityatva now puro pakshi says let the akruti be shabdartha let the akruti be the devata akruti here in this context let the devata adi akruti be nitya and the artha of the devata adi shabda in the vedas however during mahapralaya do they have the akrutis do they have resolution or not do they have resolution siddhanti says yes so in mahapralaye in mahapralaya mahapralaye akrute he api anityatvat if akruti is dissolved or resolved then this akruti is anitya if it is anitya then due to anityatvam of akruti इन महाप्रलय शब्दार्थ संबंध से अनित्यत्व जी शब्दार्थ संबंध अर्थाइज आकृति शब्दाइज नित्य बट आकृति इज बीइंग अर्था एंड बीइंग अनित्य एट लीस्ट ड्यूरिंग महाप्रलय मीनिंग During Mahaprasad, it isn't there. If it is not there, then how it is nitya? It is not nitya. Therefore, the akruti, which is shabdartha, that is anitya. Although the shabda is nitya, you will have anit nitya shabda and anitya akruti sammanda, which is anitya. Sammanda cannot be nitya anymore. And that was the objection which I made earlier, says the Puro Pakshi. So sammanda se anitya tva virodha tadavastha eva. सावस्था सावस्था सो सिद्धांति यू हैव नॉट रिजॉल्व दैट डाउट एट ऑल You have been going around with akruti and all as shabdartha to prove the nityatvam, but during mahapralaya, since it isn't there, that objection stands, still stands. It has not gone away because nityatvam means it should be there in all three periods of time. During mahapralaya, if it is not there, then it is not nitya anyway. Nitya ashankya aha. देर बाय दी नेक्स्ट सूत्र कम सब समान नाम रूपत्वा चावताव अप्यविरोध हो दर्शनात् स्मृतेश्च समान नाम रूपत्वा चावताव अपि अविरोध हो दर्शनात् स्मृतेश्च सो समान नाम रूपत्वा च आवृत्तौ अपि अविरोधः दर्शनात् स्मृतेः च दैट्स द पदच्छेद सो समान नाम रूपत्वा बिकॉज ऑफ समान नाम रूप वॉट इज समान नाम रूप बिट्वीन वन कल्प एंड दी अदर कल्प सो देर इज एन ऑन गोइंग कल्प देन देर इज महाप्रलय देन अनदर कल्प कम्स इन कम्स अप सो दिस महाप्रलय वेर आकृति इज फोल्डेड बैक इन टू अविद्या माया it is unfolded into the next kalpa as it is that is a samanatvam what is samana there nama is samana rupa is also samana so in this context devadi nama the deva indradi devata nama and indradi devata rupa 
is as it was earlier. Samana. In the earlier kalpa. Therefore, pravaha nichyatvam is there. This is what we had seen as pravaha nichyatvam earlier. That nichyatvam is cannot be discounted. What nichyatvam is the puro pakshi looking at? He is looking at something which is having continuity and that continuity is there anyway. In Mahapralaya, who is going to, during Mahapralaya, there is nothing to say this or that. Meaning, you cannot say this Nama, this Rupa, because there is nothing available as a Karna to make an analysis. So, Bija Rupa is there. In Bija, the Nama, Nama and Rupa are there in the Bija, Bija Vasta. That is why they have come up in the same manner in the next Kalpa, just like in Sushupti. In Nitya Pralaya Sushupti, the way an individual's world is there, perspective of the world, including his own self, the subject-object division, the understanding of the subject himself, and the understanding of the world around including all the karakas available at the person's disposal, they are all same the next day also, when one wakes up. So, Sushupti Prabhodavyori says the vritti, so Samana Namurupattvam is there, that is why a person thinks that there is continuity in this samsara, in this, in this world. A person who wakes up, thinks that this world is continuing. It was there when he slept. He infers, the person who has woken up, infers almost immediately. There is no pratyakshatvam there. To say that the world is there, the Indriya Vishaya Sambandha is there. But to say that the world is continuing, is there any sambandha there, any pratyakshatvam there, there is no such pratyakshatvam. The world was pratyaksha yesterday before I went to sleep. Today it is pratyaksha when I woke up. But was it there between? It is an inference. There is absolutely no pramana to say that the world was there when I slept. There is absolutely no pramana. If we say that someone else is a pramana who says that you know, my spouse, my children, my parents, whoever it is, my friends, they say that the world existed. But that they are saying that the world existed is Pratyaksha to me now. But the world is not Pratyaksha. World during my sleep is not Pratyaksha now. It, that it was Pratyaksha to them is a statement made by them and that statement is Pratyaksha to me. So, the, if you take it as an apta vakya and you say shabda pramana, due to shabda pramana, and it is an apta vakya, that apta vakya is also to be scrutinized as to whether the world was pratyaksha to them. To say that the world was pratyaksha to them, they should have existed. Did they exist then? For that, there is no pramana. Anyway, that is an aside. However, if at all we have to make an argument that in Shushupti the world was there, that is why it has unfolded now, then we have to say that the world was present in Shushupti even for the person who was sleeping. Then why did he not know? He did not know because there were no Karanas available. There was no Antak Karana, there, was, there were no Indriyas available then, they were folded. But it is not that they were not available in the sense they were not there at all. They were there. How were they there? They were there in the uh, in the Bija Vasta. Just like this Prapancha was in the Bija Vasta during Sushupti. Similar is the case of Mahapralaya. The way Nitya Pralaya is, similarly is the Mahapralaya. There in that Maya, Avidya, Bija Avastha, all of the Nama Rupas are folded. They are resolved. So, Samana Nama Rupa Tvat Cha Api 
so even if the avrutta upimi during pralaya also pralaya also avirodha there is avirodha the virodha that you are what avirodha the shabdartha sambandhasya the shabdartha sambandhasya anityatva virodha that there will be virodha in nityatva that you are claiming there will be anityatva anityatva roopa virodha to your nityatva claim of sambandha of the shabda and between the shabda and shabdartha is it tadavastha no it is not why virodha is not there so avirodha asti virodha nasti avirodha asti why darshanat smrte he cha so due to darshana darshana is shrute shruti so due to shruti as well as smrti so these pramanas will be quoted the vritti says shushupti prabodha uh, shushupti prabodhayor iva srishti pralayor आवृत्तौ अपि प्रलये प्रपंचस्य संस्कारात्मना अविद्यायां विद्यमानत्वेन पूर्वकल्पप्रपंच समाननामरूपत्वात् उत्तरकल्पप्रपंचस्य आकृतेः नित्यतया न शब्दार्थसंबन्धस्य अनित्यत्वविरोधः सो देयर इज नो सच फ्लॉ दैट यू पॉइंट आउट एज टू नित्यत्व विल बी कॉम्प्रोमाइज्ड इट वोंट बी कॉम्प्रोमाइज्ड even in pralaya why because just like shushupti going to sleep and waking up shushupti and prabodha waking up between them what has taken place when one went to sleep just before one went to sleep the prapancha the way it was when one wakes up it continues to be that way so similarly srishti and pralaya there is a similar sambandha srishti pralayor avrutta api avrutta is basically that continuity avrutti is punaravrutti again and again there is a cyclical thing going on so that avrutti just like at prabodha there is avrutti of prapancha that was before you went to sushupti सुषुप्तिवस्था सिमिलरली देर इज आवृत्ति ऑफ दिस नाम रूपात्मक प्रपंच इन दॉन्टेक्स स्पेसिफिकली इन दिस कॉन्टेक्स्ट देवता इंद्रादि देवता नाम रूपत्व इज दे इन दि आवृत्ति एक्ट ऑफ दि ऑफ दैट प्रपंच देर इज आवृत्ति ऑफ नाम रूप in the next kalpa also just like it was there in earlier srishti so avrutta api although the srishti and pralaya are having avrutti there there is a continuous srishti and pralaya at least at end of yugas kalpas ityadi similarly pralaye when pralaya takes place what happens pralaye sati prapanchasya sanskaratmana vidyamanatvat vidyamanatvena so prapancha is since the prapancha continues to be prapan prapancha samskara continues to be in the form of samskara the prapancha is there in the form of vasana or samskara there is an impression of the the entire prapancha including indradi devatas in the bija in the bija which bija avidya avidya is maya सो अविद्यायां विद्यमान कस्य विद्यमान प्रपंच से किेण संस्कारात्मन स्वूपेण संस्कार स्वूपेण संस्कार रूपेण संस्कार रूपेण आत्मना देरेस रूपेण अविद्यायां विद्यमान पूर्वकल्प प्रपंच सामनाम देर फोर दिस संस्कार ऑफ प्रपंच विच इज देर it will unfold in the same manner that samskara will cause the next kalpa also to open up in the same manner open up the prapancha in the same manner that was there 
देर फोर पूर्व कल्प संस्कार विल अनफोल इन दि उत्तर कल्प इन अमिलर मैनर द प्रपंच पूर्व कल्प प्रपंच एंड उत्तर कल्प प्रपंच विल है समान नाम रूप सो पूर्व कल्प प्रपंच समान नाम रूप उत्तर कल्प प्रपंच से आकृति है नित्यतया दे आकृति वॉट इज दृति इट इज बेसिकली नाम रूप दि रूप स्पेसिफिकली रूप हियर आकृति इज रूप बिकॉज आकृति वॉज डिस्कस्ड एज दि मीनिंग ऑफ दि नाम सो नाम इंद्रादि देवता नाम रूप कंटिन्यू नाम कंटिन्यूस एंड दि इंद्रादि रूप ऑलसो कंटिन्यूस हाउ द रूप इज आकृति दैट ऑलसो कंटिन्यूस इन नेक्स्ट प्रपंच नेक्स्ट उत्तर कल्प प्रपंच सो दि नेक्स्ट कल्प प्रपंच हेज दि सेम नाम एंड आकृति मीनिंग दैट नाम विल हेव लिंक टू दि सेम आकृति एज इट वॉज देर अर्लियर सो देर इज सिमिलटी समानम इज देर बिटवीन पूर्व कल्प नाम एंड उत्तर कल्प नाम एंड सिमिलरली दि पूर्व कल्प आकृति रूप विच स्टूड फॉर दैट पर्टिक्युलर दो पर्टिक्युलर नाम सिमिलरली the uttara kalpa akruti will also which is rupa will also stand for those particular they will also stand for those particular namas akrutis will stand for the same namas like the earlier therefore there is samana nama rupatvam and thereby the akruti will become what nitya pravah nityatvam is there so nityataya na shabdartha sambandhasya anityatva virodha that anityatva kind of a virodha isn't there at all between nitya and anit nitya nama and anitya akruti why is it not there because akruti is no longer anitya akruti is also nitya by pravah nityatvam the nityatvam the akruti continues to be therefore it is nitya and akruti being nitya nama is already nitya the sambandha between nama and akruti meaning shabda and shabdartha meaning pada and padartha is nitya that is not at all refuted by you the purva pakshi so virodha nasti avirodha katham samana nama rupatvam if that be the question of purva pakshi darshana smritischa due to darshana and smriti due to shruti and smriti what is the darshana shruti dhata yatha purva kalpayat सो so, धाता विधाता ईश्वर जगत्कर्ता यथा पूर्व तथा अकल्पयत यथा इज देर सो तथा कैन बी इमेजिंड इफ इट इज नॉट देर यथा पूर्व हाउ डिड ही क्रिएट इन द नेक्स्ट कल्प एक्जैक्टली द वे इट वॉज देर अर्लियर सो ही दी जगत्कर्ता परमात्मा परब्रह्म अकल्पयत ही मैनिफेस्टेड दि यूनिवर्स इन द सेम मैनर दैट वाज देयर अर्लियर इति श्रुतौ दर्शनात् दर्शना इज इन श्रुति इट इज सीन प्रत्यक्षतया इट इज सीन इन श्रुति एंड देन व्हाट इज द स्मृति यथर्तृ यथर्तृश्रु टिलिंग सो दिस आई विल जस्ट ब्रेक दिस डिफिकल्ट टू प्रोनाउंस यथा ऋतुषु ऋतुषु ऋतुलिंगा सो यथर्तु ऋतुलिंगा नाना पर्य दृश्य तथा भाव युगादिषु इत्यादि स्मृतेश्च एंड देर आर सेवरल सच स्मृति ऑलसो सच एज वॉट यथा ऋतुषु ऋतुलिंगा so as the ritu goes so now let's say shishir ritu is going on what is what are the characteristics lingas in this uh, shishir ritu even if you do not look at a panchanga till you know as to the weather tells you there are lingas they tell you that this is shishir ritu <coughs> why sorry so because earlier you have experienced this so these lingas continue to be whatever are the characteristics in a particular ritu they'll keep on repeating in the next ritu also 
next ruthu in the sense the same ruthu in the next year so there is cyclical continuity of ruthus and there is continuity of set of characteristics also of the same ruthu so yatha ruthushu ruthulingani nana roopani pariyaye drishyante so pariye nana roopani bhavanti tani tani eva drishyante yugadishu tatha bhava yugadishu so similarly all these bhavas bhavas are vishayas all the objects of the prapancha the indradi devatas also they yuga yugadishu tani tani eva drishyante so there is continuity as explained in the smriti also so smriti also talks about the same thing as to pravaha nityatvam of nama roopa of entire prapancha including indradi devatas itham abhitam devanam adhikaram akshipati now puru pakshi says okay you have explained all this but now new kind of issues come up so different perspectives are taken as to answer those as to whether devatas have adhikara in vidya at all and i had explained earlier as to vidya can stand for brahma vidya as jnana as well as brahma vidya or other vidyas as upasana so vidya is a common word for jnana matra as well as upasana so what are the other acharyas what are the opinions of the other acharyas or what is the perspective of other acharyas as to devatas having adhikara in vidya do they agree or do have do they have a different perspective that is taken up and siddhanta has a siddhanti concludes as to whether devatas have adhikara in vidya or not that they can have adhikara has already been explained इत्थम अभिहित देवानाम अधिकारम आक्षेपति सो देर इज आक्षेपाटन एज टू अधिकार ऑफ देवाज इन विद्या कुत्र विद्यासु मध्वादिश्व असंभवाद अनधिकार जयमिनी मध्वादिश्व असंभवाद अनधिकार जयमिनी सो जयमिनी आचार्य मनते वॉट डज जयमिनी आचार्य से there is a viroda all these possibilities are discussed but there is some viroda what is that viroda the adhikaratva adhikaritvam that puravimamsa analyzed pretty well now there is an issue as to in madhu brahmana there is madhu vidya madhu is hani and then some pairs are looked at as to this is madhu and this is how you do upasana vidya on madhu so that therefore it is called as madhu vidya so in that madhu vidya if at all aditya has to be seen as madhu this surya is madhu असौवादित्यो देव मधु सो दैट मधु दृष्टि इन दैट आदित्य सूर्य कैन इट बी डन बाय सूर्य हिमसेल्फ आदित्य हिमसेल्फ आदित्य देवता हाउ कैन आदित्य देवता हैव मधु दृष्टि इन आदित्य देवता देर फोर देर इज सम कॉन्ट्राडिक्शन देर नॉट सम देर इज complete virodha rather although there is adhikara the same acharya has established in purva mimamsa sutras there is adhikara because there is no the all the three qualifications are set right icha is there there is no nisheda also and thereby uh, we saw uh, there is third also so there is no nisheda there is ichha also 
एंड विग्रह इज देर देर फोर सेवा इत्यादि सेवादि संभव इज देर सो इच्छा संभव सेवादि संभव एंड अनिषेद अपरुदस्तत्व सो ऑल दीज हैव बीन डिस्कस्ड बाय इन मीमांसा शास्त्र बाय द सेम आचार्य बट नाउ देर इज अ डिफिकल्टी एज टू मधु विद्या के नॉट बी डन so although adhikara is prapta by analysis still if you look at some particular sections aditya as madhu cannot be upasya by aditya himself for aditya himself aditya devata therefore there is a virodha madhvadishu asambhavat madhvadishu asambhavat anadhikaram jaiminihi आचार्य मनते अंटू दिस मधुआदि मधु आदि मधु आदि विद्या असंभव इज देर द असंभव बींग आदित्य के नॉट फॉर एग्जाम्पल मीनिंग आदित्य के नॉट हैव मधु विद्या उपासना बिकॉज ही के नॉट हैव मधु दृष्टि इन आदित्य बिकॉज ही हिमसेल्फ इज आदित्य फिर फॉर अनिग अनधिकार अनधिकार देर इज अनधिकार से जैमिनी आचार्य सो ब्रह्म विद्यायाम देवादीनाम अनधिकार जैमिन आचार्य मनते सो दि एनलिस इन दि पूर्वशास्त्र कुड बी फॉर कर्म इन विद्या दो उपासना क्वेश्चन कम्स अप देर जैमिन आचार्य से देर इज सम कैंड ऑफ अ विरोध देर फॉर अनधिकार अनधिकार कस्मा कारण What is the reason? Madhuva disho asambhavat. Unto this Madhuva di vidya, there is asambhava. What is asambhava? Asova aditya deva madhu. It aditya ha Brahma ityadesha ha. So aditya Brahma. I am not sure whether if there is a typo. Let me just cross check there because I have marked it uh, with a different kind of apostrophe. If something is missing, just me. Let me look up. Madhuva disho. अनधिकार जैमी आदित्यो ब्रह्म इत्यादेश असौ आदित्यो देव मधु या सो दैट इज टू डिफरेंट मंत्र दिस छांदोग्य थ्री डॉट वन डॉट वन एंड दी नेक्स्ट वन इज थ्री डॉट आदित्यो आदित्यो ब्रह्म आदेश आदित्य ब्रह्म इत्यादेश आदित्य ब्रह्मे इत्यादेश दैट इज Three eleven one. So first mantra of eleven section of the third chapter, and the earlier is first mantra, first section of the third uh, third chapter. So ityadi shu. So looking at aditya as madhu is possible for others who are not aditya, and aditya Brahma iti adesha iti adesha means this is a vidhi that is also possible only for non aditya but not for aditya devata. himself it is so there are multiple such mantras and this is a sampling so whichever devata is upasya that devata cannot have adhikara in that particular upasana therefore ityadishu madhu brahma adhyasana because there is an adhyasa to be done madhu brahma madhu adhyasa or brahma adhyasa brahma iti adesha so aditya is not brahma literally Aditya is not Madhu also literally, but there is Madhu drishti and Brahma drishti in non Madhu and non Brahma. But this is not an adhyasa which is due to avidya. This is an adhyasa which is in adhyasa. Adhyasa vashya we have seen. Adhyasa can be non adhyasa also for upasana. So this is a non adhyasa. It has to be purposefully made by the upasaka for a particular upasana phala. He knows that it is not literally so, but he has to keep that drishti for upasana. That is the upasana. So Madhu Surya is Madhu Surya is Brahma. This kind of an adhyasa, adhyasa is na Aditya Devata upasane shu. So Madhu Brahma adhyasa is na Aditya Devato par upasane shu. Manusya adhikari karke shu. So there is manusya. What is manusya adhikari karke shu? This kapratya, 
shows that it is a bahuri so manushya manushya adhikara are the two padas manushya adhikara yeshu upasaneshu these upasanas what kind of upasanas aditya devato upasaneshu so aditya devata upasana is the anya pada of manushya adhikara manushya adhikaraka so aditya devata upasana means manushya adhikaraka so and teshu and what is adhikara there manushya adhikara manushya is adhikara adhikara means adhikari how by arshadibhyo ach so the arshasya astiti arsha one who has piles is called as arsha arsha is piles one who has piles is called as arsha similarly here adhikar adhikara adhikara asya asti iti adhikara adhikara asya asti iti matu parthe ini if you add you will get adhikari adhikarin is the pratipadika adhikari adhikarino adhikarinah that's how it is have rupas but adhikara the shabda will remain so by a pratya the um, arshadivya ach pratya that ach is in the sense of matup itself so adhika adhikara asya asti iti adhikara meaning one who has adhikara is called as adhikara who is that manushya so adhikara asya manushyasya asti iti sah manushya ka adhikara manushya adhikara manushya adhikaraka in samasavit manushya as manushya adhikaraka so this ka pratyaya shows that it is it it uh, hints as to possibility of bahuri it does not mean that ka pratyaya is always uh, bahuriya samasanta pratyaya it can be swarthe also but most of the times uh, it would be a good guess that it is a bahuri but if manushya is adhikara how can manushya be adhikara so adhikara has to be understood as adhikara asya astiti adhikara and then manushya manushya adhikara is equal to adhikari yeshu upasaneshu tani upasanani manushya adhikaraani upasanani teshu manush manushya adhikarakeshu आदित्य देवतो उपासनेशु इत्यादिशु सो दिस काइंड ऑफ उपासना व्हिच आर मेंशन वेयर मनुष्य इज द अधिकारी एंड हु इज देवता आदित्य इत्यादि आर देवतास हियर पर्टिकुलरली व्हाट ओनली आदित्य इज मेंशन इन बोथ एग्जांपल्स वन इन वन यू हैव टू कीप मधु दृष्टि इन आदित्य इन अनदर यू हैव टू कीप ब्रह्म दृष्टि इन आदित्य सो हु इज देवता उपास्य देवता इज आदित्य सो अध्यास मधु ब्रह्म अध्यास हैज टू बी डन ऑन आदित्य देवता हु इज उपास्य इन दिस उपासना वेयर हु इज द अधिकारी मनुष्य इज द अधिकारी अधिकार मींस अधिकारी मनुष्य इज द अधिकारी इज आदित्य देवता हिमसेल्फ अधिकारी नो सो तेषाम एव आदित्यादीनाम अधिकार असंभवात सिंस दिस असंभवात इज फ्रॉम मूल from the sutra there is an impossibility that aditya himself is upasya as well upasaka therefore if he is upasya he cannot be upasaka manushya is the upasaka na hi ekasya upasya upasaka bhavah sambhavati if at all somebody says no it is possible then kartu karma virodha is there we have seen multiple times earlier in this very patha in this uh, very brahma sutra patha नहीं एक से उपास्य उपासक भाव सेम आदित्य के नॉट बी उपास्य ऑल्सो एंड उपासक ऑल्सो दि उपास्य हैज बीन मेन्शन बाय श्रुति सो उपासक यू हैव यू कैन डिस्काउंट यू के नॉट से दैट आदित्य इज उपासक ऑल्सो उपास्य यू के नॉट टेक आउट बिकॉज श्रुति वाक्य इज इर आदित्य इज उपास्य एंड देर बाय तस्य भेद निष्ठत्वात देर इज क्लियरली देर इज भेद देर इज भेद बिटवीन there has to be bheda between upasaka and upasya upasya is aditya upasaka has to be different bheda nishta the upasana should be in someone who is bhinna from the upasya 
तथा चयं प्रयोग ब्रह्म विद्या देवाधीन अधिकरोती विद्यावत्वा मधु विद्यावत इति सो तथा चयं तथा चयं प्रयोग सो दि प्रयोग दिस अनुमान इज शोन वॉट इज दुमान हियर वाय कांट आदित्यादि देवताज बी उपासकाज ऑल्सो वाय कांट दे हैव अधिकार इन उपासना इन ब्रह्म विद्या सो ब्रह्म विद्या न देवादीन अधिकरोती ब्रह्म विद्या डज नॉट सो लिटरली व्हाट डज इट मीन ब्रह्म विद्या इज दर्थरी ब्रह्म विद्या पदा इज दर्ता ऑफ द सेंटेंस डज नॉट ब्रह्म विद्या डज नॉट मेक देवाज इत्यादि देवादीज एज अधिकारी वाय बिकॉज ब्रह्म विद्या इज ऑल्सो विद्या जस्ट लाइक अदर विद्या लाइक वॉट मधु विद्या सो इन मधु विद्या देर इज नो अधिकार वाय असंभवा विरोध इज देर सो विरोध उपासक उपास्य कर्तृकर्म रूप विरोध और विरोध असंभवा अधिकार असंभव इज देर हाउ बिकॉज उपास्य उपासक एक भाव इज देर They are one. So upasya upasaka kartru karma karma virodhatve na kartru karma virodhatve na upasaka upasya virodhatve na adhikara asambhavat. In what madhu vidya? That is an example. Brahma vidya is also vidya. It is also upasana. लाइक मधु विद्या सो इन मधु विद्या इफ देर इज नो अधिकार इन ब्रह्म विद्या इज ऑल्सो देर इज नो अधिकार फॉर आदित्यादि देवता वाई बिकॉज ऑफ बीइंग विद्या बिकॉज ऑफ बीइंग उपासना सो दैट इज दी हेतु मधु विद्या वत विद्यवा सो विद्यात्वा सो बिकॉज ऑफ बिकॉज ऑफ मधु विद्या वत बिकॉज ऑफ ब्रह्म विद्या बीइंग मधु विद्या वत विद्या लाइक मधु विद्या ब्रह्म विद्या बीइंग विद्या उपासना लाइक मधु विद्या देर फोर विद्यात्वा ब्रह्म विद्या देवान न अधिकरोती डज नॉट मेक देवता दिस इज व्हाट अनुमाना इज यूज एज प्रमाणा टू एस्टैब्लिश दैट इन ब्रह्म विद्या ऑल्सो दे डू नॉट हैव देवता डू नॉट हैव अधिकार वाई Because they don't have adhikara in madhu vidya, and Brahma vidya is also vidya like madhu vidya. Therefore, vidya tvat heto ho. That becomes the heto. Udharana is madhu vidya vat. This is the perspective of Jaimini Acharya. Nanu kwachit anadi anadikarat. Kwachit anadikarat. Let's let's say that somewhere there is no adhikara. सर्वत्र अनधिकार अस्ति न न शुड गो विथ अस्ति सो नास्ति सो ननु क्वचिद अनधिकारात सर्वत्र अधिकारो नास्ति नु क्वचिद अनधिकारात न सर्वत्र या सर न सर्वत्र अनधिकार अस्ति सो मीनिंग डबल निगेशन अनधिकार नास्ति मीनिंग अधिकार अस्ति सर्वत्र अनधिकार नास्ति मीनिंग कुत्रचित अस्ति क्वचित अनधिकार न सर्वत्र अनधिकार अस्ति मीन्स समवेर देर मे बी कॉन्ट्राडिक्शन बट इट इज नॉट आई मीन देर इज नो कॉन्ट्राडिक्शन एट ऑल प्लेसेस समवेर देर इज क्वचित समवेर कुत्रचित क्वचित देर इज कॉन्ट्राडिक्शन व्हाट काइंड ऑफ कॉन्ट्राडिक्शन दी देवता who is upasya and upasaka cannot be one that kind of contradiction should be avoided so in madhu vidya where aditya should be seen as madhu udher aditya does not have aditya devata does not have adhikara so that is kwachit anadhikara kwachit kwachit virodha and thereby kwachit anadhikara due to that you cannot extend it by saying that madhu vidya vat brahma vidya api विद्या अतः तस्याम अपि ब्रह्म विद्यायाम अधिकार नास्ति यू कैनॉट मेक सच जनरलाइजेशन से पूर्व पक्षी हियर पूर्व पक्ष टू जैमिनी व्हाट डज ही से 
somewhere let there be contradiction and there let the devata lose adhikara in that particular vidya but how can you make a generalized rule for example brahmanasya rajasuya anadhikare api brahaspati save adhikara iti aashankya ah so he says rajasuya yaga has to be done by kshatriya raja it has to be done by kshatriya raja brahmana has no adhikara in that does it mean that brahmana has no adhikara in any any yaga you cannot say that brahaspati sava is also yaga like rajasuya you cannot say brahmanasya brahaspati save api adhikarah nasti kutah you can give a hetu and it will be flawed it will look at a sad hetu but it is asad hetu dosha yukta hetu you will be saying your anumana will be what you will say yatra yatra yagatvam tatra tatra brahmanasya anadhikaratvam kutah you will say yagatvat rajasuyadivat और राजसूयवत सो लाइक राजसूय विच इज अगा ब्राह्मण हेज नो अधिकार सिमिलरली बृहस्पति इज सवा इज ऑल्सो यागा बीइंग यागा द अर्लियर यागा राजसूय यागा ब्राह्मण हेड नो अधिकार एंड बृहस्पति सवा इज ऑल्सो यागा यागत्वात देर इज नो अधिकार फॉर ब्राह्मण इट्स अ फ्लॉड लॉजिक से इज दी पूर्व पक्षी टू this earlier anumana he says your anumana is flawed because we all know that brahmana has adhikara in all yagas except for a few where abrahmanas have adhikara that to particular kshatriya who has is a raja in rajasuya or in ashwamedha ityadi so you cannot generalize it इन बृहस्पति सवा ब्राह्मण डेफिनेटली हैज अधिकार इन राजसूय माभूत अधिकार लेट देर बी नो अधिकार आशंक्य आह ज्योतिषी भावाच ज्योतिषी भावाच सो भावात ज्योतिषी भावात नाउ हियर ज्योतिषी इन इन ज्योतिर्मंडला इन ज्योतिर्मंडला डू यू सी आदित्य सूर्य भावात भावात च एंड ड्यू टू प्रेजेंस भावा प्रेजेंस ऑफ हु ऑफ प्रेजेंस ऑफ विच देवता प्रेजेंस ऑफ प्रेजेंस ऑफ हुम दिस आदित्य देवता इन ज्योति इन ज्योतिर्मंडला यू सी दी सूर्य हु इज प्रत्यक्ष देवता हाउ प्रत्यक्ष देवता यू सी दैट सूर्य गोलका you see that golaka and aditya is there jyotir mandale bhavat and what are we saying you see this surya aditya in jyotir mandala as this solar disk that sun and since you see that who is that Achetana, the the Surya Golaka that you see is Achetana. So Achetana Tvat Devanam Na Vidyadikarha. That is Sutra Artha here. There is Achetana Tvat Dharana, and thereby there is no Adikara. Says the Sutra. so this is all puro paksha okay this is puro paksha sutra this is not siddhanti sutra madhvadishu asambhavad anadhikaram jaiminihi jaimini puro mimamsaka is quoted in the sutra as a puro paksha it is not siddhanta siddhanta has already been given earlier it has been given as to by quoting uh, in the uh, yeah so tadupari pi badrayana sambhavat badrayana is vedanti so this the vedanta sutras agree with 
devatas having adhikara because they are abo manushyas and manushya onwards upwards there is adhikara now with other kind of a uh, perspective other kind of a perspective there is some kind of virodha whereby jaimini acharya says in uh, these vidyas brahma vidya and all other vidyas also because of their there being some virodha there is no adhikara and jyotishi bhavaccha is also response to the question given to jaimini acharya he says jyotishi bhavaccha as to there being visibility of this aditya devata as a achetana as do you know so there is some kind of an argument made there as to the solar disk is visible and that is achetan achetana to do you see achenet achetana there when you look at aditya you say aditya is there aditya devata who is that devata pratyaksha devata in the jyotir mandala okay that devata do you don't see as devata really what do you see devata is ancient but what do you see there the achetanatva avadharana is there we understand that surya that you see as what we see as achetana so some kind of a reasoning is given to counter this puro paksha as to they let there be anadhikara in some vidyas but you cannot make a blanket uh statement that there is no adhikara for any devata in any upasana so sutra uh, is jyotishi bhavaccha kasya aditya devataya ha achen achetanatvena so the idea is that achat achetanatvena jyotishi bhavaccha aditya devataya ha laukikayoh aditya shabda pratyayoh jyotir mandale bhavat so the the shabda pratyaya what is your understanding of the shabda aditya shabda aditya shabdasya pratyaya kaha what is the pratyaya the pratiti that takes place in your mind as a listener when i say aditya iti shabda when i utter aditya what comes to your mind ask the sutra uh, the uh, who who's ever this perspective is will consider it as jaimini acharya's perspective as an as an anuvrutti from the earlier whoever it is but one who says that uh, to one who objects one who answers to one who objects as to let there be adhikara in some places and not have adhikara in all places just because there is no adhikara in some vidya let the devatas have adhikara to that whoever is answering as jyotishi bhavaccha that jaimini acharya or someone who is answering this ask the puro paksha to him to the earlier sutra to jaimini acharya as to what comes to your mind when i say aditya shabda what is your what is the pratyaya that takes your takes in place in your mind what is the pratiti so laukikayo ho aditya shabda pratyayo what is that shabda and pratyaya see what is the shabda used as when i say aditya shabda what is it what does it mean aditya shabda the sun and when i what is the pratyaya that comes to your mind so the laukika aditya shabda and laukika aditya pratyaya is what is used has existence meaning has meaning in that which is there in jyotir mandala so the shabda means the sun and the pratyaya is also that sun which is in the sky so jyotir mandale bhavat tesham asmadadi so tesham is uh, the devatas which are being discussed tesham asmad asmadadi vat ishta nishta prapti parihar roop cheshtaya adarshanena if at all the puro pakshi argues that uh, we, i mean what kind of a uh, what kind of a counter is this we are all vaidikas when we talk about aditya it is not the solar disk we know that it is that entity who is associated with the aditya vigraha meaning aditya the solar disk also see so far only vigraha roopa of the aditya devata was discussed now the jyotishi bhavaccha is making an argument that this aditya is in the sky in the jyotir mandala it is not even that vigraha van aditya devata it is that solar disk and achetana 
but then the puro paksha to that counter to that kind of a response to that counter is what it is a ridiculous argument when you say that surya is being talked about that surya is aditya devata it is not the surya as the solar disk you know it i know it why are you arguing in this manner then the counter to that is what tesham asmadadivat ishta anishta prapti parihara rupa cheshtaya adarshanena at least do you agree that we do not see the cheshta we do not see them going around trying to get what is ishta what is and avoid what is anishta like us we don't see aditya adi devatas going around doing that adarshanena we do not see that anywhere that ishta prapti and anishta yoga they are looking for that we don't see them going around doing that why अचेतनत्व अवधारणा अदर्शन सो ऑल दो दि आदित्य देवता इज टॉक्ड अबउट स्टील दि अदर्शन इज देर देर फोर दे हेड दे बीन देर देर वुड बी दर्शन सो अदर्शन अचेतनत्व अवधारणा यू कैन अंडरस्टैंड देर इज अचेतनत्व यू डो नॉट सी दि सन रन अराउंड एंड गेट समथिंग डन फॉर हिज वॉट वॉट ही लाइक्स एंड does something to avoid what he dislikes we don't see such things therefore achetanatva can be understood therefore what taditrakta taditraktasya achetanasya vigrahadi matah pratyakshad agocharatvat and then further what uh, tadatirktasya achetanasya प्रत्यक्षादि अगोचरत्वात् विग्रहादि मता सो विग्रहादि तदितरिक्त तदतिरिक्तस्य अचेतनस्य विग्रहादि मता हा सो इफ इफ इट ऑल यू से आई डोंट नो व्हाइट इस लेट मी क्रॉस चेक दैट अचेतनत्व अवधारणा तदित तदतिरिक्तस्य अचेतनस्य विग्रहादि मता हा प्रत्यक्षादि अगोचरत्वा हाँ ओके सो अदर देन दिस सो इफ एट ऑल यू से इट इज नॉट द सोलार डिस्क सो अचेतन तो अवधारणा इज देर वी अंडरस्टैंड दिस बाय नॉट बीइंग एबल टू सी आदित्य रनिंग अराउंड गेटिंग हिज इष्टा प्राप्ति एंड अनिष्ट वियोग सम अंडरस्टैंडिंग ऑफ अचेतन तो इज देर हैड इट बीन चेतना हैड आदित्य बीन चेतना that aditya would also have run around for ishta prapti and anishta yoga but still he is not doing so therefore we make an assumption we conclude that aditya is achetana this is the general argument there then tad itariktasya achetanasya meaning you do not see someone achetana other than this aditya who is achetana surya who is achetana here who is having a vigraha vigrahadi matah pratyakshadi agocharatvat we haven't seen anyone who has a body achetana who has a body through pratyaksha pramana pratyakshadi pramanas do not land in some kind of an understanding that achetana with a body vigraha runs around or does something we don't have such pramana available also so what understanding we have got from earlier adarshana that has to hold good you can counter it by pratyakshadi pramana but do you have pratyakshadi pramana to counter the adarshana landing to the conclusion that surya is achetana you do not therefore what pratyakshadi agocharatvat तद विग्रहादि प्रतिपादकाना मंत्राणाम अन्य परत्वेन स्वार्थे प्रामाण्य अभावात् न देवानाम विद्या अधिकारा इति सूत्र द्वयस्य तात्पर्यार्था। So since सूत्र द्वय has been mentioned, the assumption that the earlier सूत्रा in ज्योतिषी this this सूत्रा current सूत्रा ज्योतिषी भावाच्च with and also च we can bring down अनुर्त्य जैमिनी। So if जैमिनी आचार्य is asked as to Let there be asambhava in some uh, uh, due to asambhava due to asambhava in some vidyas. Let there be no adhikara of devata di in such vidyas, but not in all vidyas. He has answered by saying jyotishi bhavaccha. Taking example of 
uh, Aditya is said. So if Aditya is somewhere else, somewhere, then other devatas also. So if say Indra, will Indra have Adhikara? So the, we can read another counter. Oh, you are saying Jyotishi Bhava Cha. So in Jyotir Mandala, you are saying Surya, but are you saying Indra? So uh, uh, Puro Paksha to Jaimini can be read as, okay, let Indra Devata have Adhikara in some Upasanas. Why do you deny it to Indra Devata also? There Jaimini Acharya would answer as to, uh, Indra Devata is also there in, the, in Indra Loka. So somewhere he is in Indra Loka, do you see him, Adarshana, Achetanatva, Adhar? So all these arguments can continue. But with an example of Surya, he has said that Jyotishi Bhavacha. Therefore, how do you... Uh, uh, since you have concluded that uh, Adityadi Devatas do not have Adhikara, then what are these discussions in the Shastra about? What, are, what is the Shastra statement itself about? As to what? The Vigrahas. There is Vigraha being talked about. You have not seen a Vigraha, says the Puropakshi to Jaimini Acharya, Vigraha di Mataha Pratyaksha Diagocharatvat. You have not seen the Vigraha of someone. So, Atirktasya Chetanasya also can be read. I personally, I, you know, Tad Atirktasya Achetanasya has been written here. That's why I was checking whether Tad Atirkta, Tad Atirkta, when you say then Achetanatva has gone by earlier. So, Tad Atirkta should be Chetana. But for some reason here, uh, Achetana is there, that can also be seen. Uh, does anyone have a patha where it is Chetana? Or is it, or, or is it Achetana in your patha or Achetanasya? I have Achetana only. Achetana only, right? So if we hmm. will say that we have Tam not seen Achetana, uh, hmm. roaming around anywhere. So, so Vigrahadi Mat, Achetana Vigrahadi Mat cannot be Achetana. So that's why there is a doubt. But let's say, assume that and go ahead as to Pratyakshadi Agocharatva. They are also not Pratyakshadi Gochara. Whether Chetana or Achetana, Vigrahadi Man Adityadi Devata is not available for for Pratyaksha and other Pramanas also. So what Pramana is there? Shruti Pramana is there. There is a discussion as to such Vigraha is there. Shruti Smriti pram, Ityadi Pramanas are there as to Aditya has some kind of Vigraha. So what about those Vigraha Adi Vakyas? Tad Vigraha Adi Pratipadakanam Vakyanam Mantranam. Those Mantras which discuss Vakyas which discuss the Vigraha for Adityadi Devatas, Indra Devata, you know, Vajrasta Ityadi. Aditya has whatever number of horses and all that. All these stories are there with Aditya also having a particular Rupa Ityadi. So carries a uh, whatever, you know, like we say uh, Pratyaksha Narayana himself for us. We say that Aditya here Surya is what? Uh, Surya Narayana. And then we imagine Narayana's form which is there for Surya also. Similar kind of a form. So, mantranam anya paratvina, there is anya paratvam. They are not committed to revealing just that rupa, meaning the rupa is not literally so. They don't have such rupa at all. Such vigraha is not there. So, although vigraha is there, discussed, vigraha is discussed in the shastra, is revealed in the shastra, pratipadakatvam is there. Vigraha pratipadaka vakyas are there, mantras are there. But they don't have swartha. They do not have the literal meaning. They are anyapara. They are for some other purpose. And therefore, swartha, swartha meaning not be there. Then swarthe pramanya abhavat. Pramanya is not there in swartha. Meaning literal meaning should not be taken of these vigraha. Say Jaimini Acharya. Na devanam vidyadikara. Therefore, vigraha is lacking. Now, having said that, Vigraha is also there. See, these sutras, Jaimini sutras that we had quoted earlier, they were not in support of devatas. We took them in the support of devatas because we, says, we said that Ichha is possible. Uh, there is no Nisheda, so Anisheda is there. And using the same Jaimini sutras, we, throw, show, we had shown the third Hetu also 
as to vigraha be in their seva bhava can is possible therefore even as per jaimini acharya devatas have adhikara but he does not say so his sutras can be applied here but then he says if you have used these sutras also kurme or my sutras there is an issue with the vigraha itself vigraha is not there at all this vigraha is not in swartha so swarthe pramanya bhavat anya paratvena devanam vidyadikara nasti eva iti sutra dvese tatparya artha so jaimini acharya sutras are applied by taking vigraha literally says jaimini acharya to vedantin vedantin says vigrahas are there then purva mimamsaka jaimini acharya explains that vigrahas are not swartha they should not be taken literally they are there for upasana all right but such vigrahas are not there इत्थम पूर्व पक्षे प्राप्ते सती सिद्धांत यति देन सिद्धांत व्हाट बादरा आचार्य हैज गिवन दैट इज क्लोज दैट इज गिवन इन द क्लोजिंग सूत्र टू एंड द अधिक दिस अधिकरण सो अधिकरण देवता अधिकरण गेट्स ओवर विद दिस 33rd सूत्र विल सी इन द नेक्स्ट पार्ट एंड देन विल मूव विद अ कंट्रोवर्शियल अधिकरण अपशूद्र अधिकरण नमस्ते धन्यवाद